Hello, everyone. This is Deb Purcell, and I'm coming to you today to uh, bring to you a message uh, from a dear friend of mine and also a spiritual teacher. Her name is Christine Presson. One of her videos was removed from YouTube recently, and it was a uh, telepathic channeled message from Archangel Michael, uh, I believe. Uh, let me bring that up in front of me. What I'm going to do is I'm going to read the message and uh, post this video so that uh, it is back out there on YouTube. Um, it was uh, done electronically in an electronic voice and for some reason that message was removed and I wanted to get the message back out there for her uh, because it's a very important message for people to receive. Um, so this is the best way that I know how to get the message back out. So I'm going to read it to you. Um, this message is uh, dated March 19th, 2020. And I'm going to read it verbatim. It will alter, I'm sorry, yeah. it will alter the world forever. This is Archangel Michael via Christine Preston, March 19th, 2020. Hi, friends, lightworkers, and listeners. I have received a dictation of the word for word type from Archangel Michael by telepathic communication as usual on March 17th. With this method of dictation, I write down the message at the same time as it is being dictated. There were a few details of a personal nature which I have removed from the, this message. Include, including a prophecy for my family. During the last three days to a week, I have gained a very good understanding of the higher dimensional point of view as regards the coronavirus crisis, especially thanks to this message. For more information, I post my list of videos on my Facebook page and in those published from February 2016. You will find a dozen with details on the prophecies given to me by Archangel Michael in relation to the election of President Trump, which were fulfilled. He gave me those prophecies because of, a, of, a, of the crucial part this election was to play according to the divine plan of liberation of St. Germain at this time of our transition into the Aquarian age. The state of bondage that mankind has to be freed from is related to a control of minds for power by the dark forces. We have been in Armageddon of the psyche and my videos contain some theological concepts relating to a path of initiation, as well as the fact that it is by an in integration of higher consciousness that we progress upon the path and can eventually ascend. However, I explain that the goal is not to escape the material or physical world, this dimension, but to raise its vibration as well so we can eventually be returned to a state of being that corresponds to the paradise of the book of Genesis. So we will be shifting to a higher density or dimension. Before this, we are due to create a golden age following a prosperity and peace that will appear for all nations. The forces of, of the light are working on our liberation from the old systems and structures that serve the agenda of those agents of the dark forces who seek to keep or regain control in the great battle that has been going on for a very long time. For listeners who are not familiar with my videos, it was in 2015 that Archangel Michael told me I was accepted to function as a messenger for the Great White Brotherhood, a, tradi a traditional term for the spiritual hierarchy of our multi-dimensional system of world. This was following a training that I received during 2014, which familiarized me with the realm of telepathic communication. I do the ritual of calling to, the, to my I am presence for the tube of light, and I do some decrees to Archangel Michael for protection from interferences because it has been recommended by him and this has to take place before receiving a message. I feel an irradiation of love and light. 
I have previously called this contact a close encounter of the surreal kind. It is an experience of supernatural nature that I experienced while decreeing or praying for about 30 years before I developed the ability for telepathic communication six years ago. The Archangel Michael, who has given me this message, is the same who manifested his presence to me during these previous decades when I practiced the ritual of prayer according to the method released by the Ascended Masters through the messengers who found the Summit Lighthouse. Archangel Michael has told me to keep my focus on that feeling when he dictates. So what follows is his message. This is your beloved Archangel Michael. I want to say that I could not wait for this moment of happiness when we connect. I must tell you that we have arrived at the auspicious time from our point of view, us, the archangels, as the world needs a shakeup and it is happening at last as the position of the stars permit it. The Saturnian influences from the astrological point of view are affecting the world as a whole in the sense they are restricting all of you in your daily lives through the measures that have to be taken to ensure or guarantee your safety. Those draconian measures will serve or will be a challenge that will shake people's flexibility. There is a cure or antidote for the infection, but it is in the hands of the power elite, Illuminati, or evil pyramid of control, the same who have created this virus, and they will not disclose this. This is locked up in some distant laboratories. They have made it for themselves. You have to understand the reason is that they want to create chaos in the world <clears throat> to stop the progress of enlightenment. It is not just to cause some interferences with the elections of November. It is to do with the more general spirituality and the rise of people into what so many call the awakening, but also beyond that. They cannot stand the enlightenment because it makes people escape their control. The situation now is that it has slipped out of their hands. What they hoped to do was to create enough problems to divert attention to more basic problems of survival, but it has gone out of hand. Now the situation is taking a wider scale to the point of having the opposite effect as it's shaking up the foundations of society and having a deconstruction effect, which will alter the structures and systems of the world forever. It's demolishing the boundaries they have set up long ago to constrict everything, even minds and thinking. So this will lead to finding solutions, measures for a time, but then questions will be asked and the new systems will be found more convenient. Once liberated and having survived, people will not want to be returned to the monotony of the ancient structures of society. If this solidifies, the process will continue next year. They will throw off more chains with Aquarius and its influences of freedom. That's what we think will happen. The advancement of mankind will rely on grounding in legal justice and, of course, the vehicle for this is the work of St. Germain and Lady Portia through President Trump and his team. So you can well imagine that this administration is intent on keeping on the right path and doing the right thing. It is out of the question. It is <laughs> to use devious methods such as cover-up to make arrests, which would be carried out in this scenario. In secret, just as it is done by some oligarch, oligarchy, I can't say the word, some dictators, some power elite or warlords that are able to act on their own and command armies. The president has to have most of his ventures pass through Congress and the Senate to be able to accomplish anything. A number of problems would arise if he did anything without following the rules of law. They are outlined in the Constitution. You have already had a taste of what would happen from the false claims made by the opposition party in the hope that an impeachment could put Donald Trump out of the way. 
they did this purely because they have run out of other options to have a chance in the race for the election. If the virus problem reappears in the fall, as the astrology indicates, that will not stop Donald Trump in this track. He will get to work. However, if the return of crisis continues during the winter of 2020, I'm sorry, 2021, in that case, his inauguration could not take place in the usual way with people gathering together. If there was still a problem with the coronavirus requiring people to remain in isolation to continue the virus, that is the scenario that corresponds to what an astrologer ha has seen in his chart as a problem at the time of the inauguration without being able to figure out what could possibly go wrong. However, the virus will also decrease in strength or in effect as people change and embrace more spiritual outlook on life. The reason for this is that it is karmic, the karmic pale horse of the ride of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, a period when the veils are removed and when the many changes that take place will have a general uplifting effect as a result of the eradication of many evils and wrong, wrong systems of control. It is not a time in which people need to prepare for an extermination by disease. No, it's, it's the evils of this world which are due to end. We will have to redo this soon again. I am with you always, Archangel Michael. End of dictation. On this note, may you be kept safe and secure more than ever. With love from Christine. It's a beautiful message. And I have to say that um, Christine has some beautiful, beautiful messages and many, many, many more uh, YouTube videos. If you just look under Christine Preston, and I am going to post the written word um, under this video, Christine's link on Facebook and links to her many other videos also on here, because I'm gonna tell you, if you don't follow Christine Preston, you should. She is a beautiful teacher um, and I highly recommend her. I follow her, I've been following her for years and I um, highly recommend her, highly recommend her. Much love everybody.